The MCAD co-designer extension is able to transfer 3D models of PCB components to all supported MCAD systems. But when you receive a board in MCAD, you may get a warning that some component models cannot be properly imported. This is caused by the fact that 3D models of components from Altium Designer are converted at the first project push to MCAD. Such a conversion is necessary to unify all components to ensure the highest possible compatibility with all supported MCAD systems, to correctly position components on the MCAD assembly, to correctly process them, and to synchronize their movements. However, not all component models can be correctly processed and converted, and in such cases, this error occurs. Note that the failed components have been added to the assembly anyway as transparent bounding boxes. Each of the bounding boxes has the overall dimensions of the original component. Don't worry if you get such a warning. The erroneous components can be corrected by Altium Designer. Conversion does not affect single body parasolid models. So if you encounter such a warning, you should replace the erroneous 3D model for each erroneous component footprint with a converted parasolid model and then synchronize the project again. In most cases, components have embedded 3D models as part of the footprint. If you don't have access to the model files, you can export the models for all components in one place, then convert them manually in the next step. To export 3D models, first, it is necessary to generate a library of all footprints used in the project. This is easy to do with the tool Design, Make PCB Library. After library generation, we see a list of all footprints of the project components. The Tools Extract 3D Models option is used to bulk export all embedded 3D models from the footprints. By choosing a convenient File Save option, we get a complete set of component models. Now, let us open the error causing model in Mechanical CAD. All that is required to do is to save it as a model in the Parasolid file format. Repeat this conversion process for all erroneous models in your project. After you have prepared all the necessary models, you can proceed to the next step, replacing the previous models with the new ones in each erroneous footprint. To quickly find the desired component in the repository, copy its name, switch to the Explorer panel, paste it into the search bar and press enter. Find our footprint in the list of related elements, right click on it and select the edit option. Since our models are absolutely identical to each other, we can remember the coordinates of the previous model to repeat them for the new one. Remove the previous model and insert a new one using the place 3D body tool. Repeat the location coordinates and then save the footprint on the server, updating all related components in the storage. Since we created a new revision of the component when we saved it, all previously placed components became obsolete. By opening the schematic editor, we can use the tools Item Manager to quickly replace obsolete components. Sort the components by state. Select the components with the obsolete state, right click on them and select the Update to Latest Revision option. Then apply ECO changes to the project. Close the item manager and return to the PCB. Apply the changes using design, import changes. After importing the changes, push the updated board with the fixed components to the mechanical engineer and pull it from the MCAD side. After pulling and accepting the changes, we don't get any errors when importing models and our components are fully and correctly displayed.